He's creating a buzz mm. in the food industry with a product and business model that's a real stress reliever for both buyers and sellers. CBS News' Lauren Victory takes us inside the proud minority-owned company that's spreading its wings by O'Hare. You've heard of farm to table. At Heaven's Honey, it's from comb to home. They collect local beekeepers' surplus. Then fill the public's desire for raw, unfiltered honey. How many stores is this in? We're in over 200 stores. Customer Christina Fantosi dollops Heaven's Honey over all sorts of food, and not just for the taste. One of the first changes I started to see since using this honey was my allergies kind of become less. Good for the body and the bees. Handlers must follow founder Abdullah Matawala's rules. We make sure that they're not using any pesticides or chemicals in their vegetation. He explains how his Bensonville business model is mixing up the industry. Instead of the farmer going to the farmer's market, setting up a tent, putting up a table, um, and selling, let's say, $200 worth of product that day or a little bit more, we're purchasing in the thousands from them. Buying in bulk does mean selling their product at a lower price per pound, but it also allows the beekeepers to focus on their honey makers. Not having to worry about sales and just worry about, you know, uh, upkeep. He knows that I'm in a small business that's up and growing. Commercial bee farmer Abdullah Felton actually declined an offer to sell to Heaven's Honey. He wants to focus on his own customer base at Felton Farms. Still, it's almost like a charitable act. He was touched by Matawala's sweet gesture to help him expand. Uh, he's linked me up with people that reach out to him. Uh, there's a place in Willow Springs, Illinois, for example, that they want beehives on their property. A growing network. Our cinnamon honey. And a growing company. Uh, our hot honey, which we use fresh peppers for. Next up, adding to the popular line of naturally infused flavors. And finding a bigger workspace. Lauren Victory, CBS 2 News. 20 beekeepers and counting work with Heaven's Honey. They're based across Illinois and Wisconsin.